So have I become your enemy by telling you the truth? People of ambiguity are typically an enemy of truth. People who work to delude the message of God's prophecies tend to make themselves hostile toward God. Here are the exact words from the Lord through Jesus' half-brother. You adulteresses, do you not know that friendship with the world is hostility toward God? Therefore, whoever wishes to be a friend of the world makes himself an enemy of God. That's right out of James chapter 4, verse 4. Fact, those who place the importance of friendship over the immovability of the Lord's prophecies are nothing less than an enemy of truth. Since Jesus is the truth, when believers shift their loyalty to friendships, betrayal is the worst. Betrayal in its worst form arrives on the doorstep of the kingdom of God with hostility. We make ourselves an enemy of God. Here are the questions that Biblical Paul most likely wanted to ask the Galatian church after he devoted his life to establish them as a church. For example, what happened to this church? Why did the Galatians betray him? Or worse yet, the gospel of Jesus Christ. When the Galatians invited Paul for his first visit, he was received as a quote-unquote angel of God. After time had passed, the Galatians drifted into the worthless elements of life, and Paul was informed of their weakening demise. Thus, he was compelled to write them a letter, which became the book of Galatians. And here's a fact. Christians are known for shooting their own, far more than authentic persecution. 